Hello, happy Wednesday, August 30th, 2023. Here is the KTA news for today. Huge congratulations and shout out to Miss Carazosa's class. They are our newest golden plate recipients. Nice job, Miss Carazosa's class. I'm proud of you. I also want to give a shout out to all three of our middle school grades. So our sixth, seventh, and eighth graders. Their advisory classes have all earned a extra advisory recess. So that will be up to your advisory teachers to determine when you guys are going to get those and receive them. But if you are in the NPR, you will notice your ticket tubes and all middle school students have received, they have gotten to the halfway point on their ticket tubes, earning them an extra recess. So nice job, sixth graders, nice job, seventh graders, great job, eighth graders. Fifth grader Ian Stewart got to go to Odyssey Aquarium and do a helmet dive experience. I have been to Odyssey before and I've seen people do this. It's absolutely amazing. So these pictures are showcasing um, what Ian was able to do. I'm going to show you a quick video of his as well. And that is so amazing. Thank you so much for sharing that with us. Look at all the animals he got to see underwater. What an amazing experience. I want to thank everyone for their hard work on the readathon. Here are our final numbers and updates. As a total KTA K through eighth grade school, we read 95,390 minutes. 78% of individuals here at KTA participated, 82% of our middle school students participated, which is, which is wonderful. So thank you, middle school students, for really leading our school and participating in this readathon. Our winners for the popcorn party in each grade are Miss Cano's class, Miss Mills, Miss Bertaki, Miss Gallinetti. Miss Mallon and Miss Twaits. Hmm. Interesting. That's two fourth grade teachers. I might have to ask if that is, if those are the correct teachers. Um, it looks like for sure Miss Twaits with 9,560 minutes. Miss Gilby, Mr. Smith, and Miss Haas. On Monday, the prize cart came around. I got to see the prize cart going around to all classrooms, and there were over 2,300 prizes given out for everybody's hard work. Wonderful job. Another friendly reminder that this Friday will be College Colors Day. Wear your college colors and teachers, make sure that you are showcasing all of your colleges, okay? Dr. Lesher is really gonna watch us and wanna see every college represented as much as you can. I hope everybody has a phenomenal Wednesday and we will see you tomorrow. Go Tigers!